What is up guys, The Collector19 here and today we'll be reviewing the Age of Heroes Takami Keigo or Hawks from My Hero Academia, a figure by Ben Presto. So, here we go. So before we get started, make sure to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel. I post videos every Wednesdays and Saturdays or better yet, hit that notification bell so you will always get notified every time I make an upload. Also you can check me out in my social media accounts, links are in the description below. So as you can see we have here the new Age of Heroes Hawks. This just came in the other day. I got this off Toy Zone Express. Got it for a very good deal. And I saw him. I just I was just randomly um, browsing Shopee and I found him. And I didn't know that we already have this in the Philippines. So there's that. So I pulled the trigger on him immediately because I like the figure. I like the character. So who is Takami Keigo or Hawks? Hawks is already ranked second among the pro heroes. He was third before and now he is second after Endivore which is on the first spot. So Hawks has a quirk of fierce wings where he can basically fly at an incredible speed. He can also command the feathers of his wings at will by using his mind or telepathy. So that's a little background on our wing hero Hawks here and let's take a look at the box. So there's the front, a good shot of Hawks. And at the back, it says Age of Heroes behind him. The My Hero Academia logo there. Number 12 of the Age of Heroes line. The Band Presto logo up top. The Bandai logo there. Some Japanese stuff. And it says Age of Heroes, Hawks, and Red Riot. So onto the side, we can see another shot of Hawks by the upper part of the figure. It says Age of Heroes and Hawks there. Actual size, color, style, and decoration may vary. Okay. So at the back, we can see the figure in its entirety. So the same number 12, Age of Heroes logo at the back, the figure, Hawks, and it says A, Hawks, and B is Red Riot. This one is a grayscale version of the Ejiro Hiroshima Age of Heroes. So there's a UPC there, Bandai Spirits, Cole Limited, and same stuff, same stuff. On the side, we can see a different angle of the Hawks figure with the same text which says Age of Heroes and Hawks. And then up top, we can see Age of Heroes, a UPC there, and the Media Link sticker. Denoting that this is a legit figure by Ben Preso and it's not a third party or a bootleg or a knockoff. So on the bottom of the box, we can see the licensing stuff and the warning there. So with that being said, let's take Hawks out of the box and let's assemble the figure. So here is the Carter 19. Always, um take precautions when opening a box with a cutter or any sharp object and um, the past few Ben Prestos I have opened I butchered the top flap so let's see if I would butcher it the third time maybe third times the charm so let's go oh man I creased it oh, I should have used a ruler never mind so here is the social media of Ben Presto their Facebook page and their Instagram and WeChat accounts so make sure to pay those a visit and yeah, make sure to follow and like them. So, oh, so okay, so we have here another layer of cardboard. So just gonna take that off. Oh, so it comes in one piece. So. Okay, that's that. So there. There, um, we have to open it. It's kind of hefty, I gotta say. It's really hefty, even outside the box. The box felt kind of hefty. So we have um, four, five, five. We have five pieces to build there. So let's make our way to open this package up and assemble Hawks. So here we are, here are the parts and let's take a look at Hawks' face first, so there's a little smirk on his face there. I really like the goggles. The material used is not just um, a plastic, but it's um, a transparent plastic. I like the hair sculpt, really nice, and he has his um, earmuffs or earphones. Some little beard there. 
and yeah so let's check the wings the wings look good there's very detailed I like the finish and there's a little and there's a plug there you'll plug on his back you'll need to plug those to his back there the other wing yeah i like it and let's get to the body there so great detail there are ruffles all around um at the edges of his coat there really nice i really like the um, wrinkles of the suit and yeah looking at it i think you don't have any um issues on the figure uh i don't i don't think these are weatherings but yeah it's no problem at all because the wings will block it so you won't be able to see it besides it, it's in the back so the boots really look good like the wrinkles on it some weathering there so yeah guys let us assemble hawks so we'll just plug his head onto the peg hole there very easy just like that there and yeah i poke holes on my fingers so next up are the wings so let's attach the first wing the right wing just like so be careful guys don't don't force it too hard and the other wing just like so there and he has a base a simple base matte finish base there the base has pegs on it so you can plug hawks onto the base but i believe he does stand without the base on so there you have it guys really nice it looks better in person honestly but yeah i think it's gonna tip over it's a little top heavy yeah it looks good the figure looks good so uh let's just attach him to the base so he stands firm the only thing that i don't like with the kind of this kind of basis is that you have to stretch the legs in order to um plug the figure in so it's easy but yeah you might you might damage the figure if you stretch the legs in a um wide position in a wider position so there is hawks i really like the figure it looks nice the details are awesome and yeah check it out guys it's awesome So Hawk stands at uh, roughly seven and a half inches tall, and and he has the base on. So maybe he's uh, a little um, shorter when he doesn't have the base on. So for the size comparison, we have here the Shoto Todoroki texture figure, and they are almost of the same size because texture figures are seven inches tall. But if you look at them closely, the texture figures are quite larger than the Age of Heroes and Amazing Heroes figures. And speaking of Amazing Heroes figures, I have here Chako Uraraka from the Amazing Heroes line. So they all stand almost at the same sizes, but like I said, the texture ones are quite larger than most of the My Hero Academia lines in the Banpresto area. So in the middle, we have the Age of Heroes Hawks, the texture to the Roki, and the Amazing Heroes Chako Uraraka. This one is also one of my um, recent Van Presto figures, Chaco. So that's it guys for the review of this Age of Heroes Hawks figure by Van Presto. And final thoughts, it stands tall, the details are awesome. I really like the details, Every the sculpt of the wings, the sculpt of the hair, it's on point. And the face sculpt, it captures the likeness of Hawks in the show. So if you're interested in copying this figure, I got this off the Toy Zone Express. I got it off um, for retail. Usually, Ben Presto figures cost about around 850 pesos at the minimum. And yeah, you really get your money's worth on Ben Presto figures because aside from being affordable and um, budget friendly, 
you get very detailed figures. Ben Presto figures is a bang for your buck. So once again, if you're interested in copying the figure, make sure to check Toy Zone Express out. I believe the figure is selling out fast because because collectors are excited to have Hawks in their collection. And I believe this is um, the very first. Oh no, this is one. Is, it's the second, if I'm not mistaken. The first one is the Master Lease, the Japan exclusive Hawks, and this one would be the second. Don't quote me on that, but I think it's the second. And we'll also get a future Hawks figure from the Amazing Heroes line. So I'm excited to cop that as well. And hopefully in the future, we'll get a Funko Pop version of him. So that's my input, guys. So okay, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, hit that post notification bell, and make sure to check me out in my social media accounts. So once again, guys, this has been The Collector, and this has been Hawks, The Age of Heroes figure by Ben Presto. Thanks for watching, let's collect plus ultra and I'll see you in the next video.